do I need o kailangan mo bang i-print ang boarding pass? Sagutin natin yan sa video na to. Hey, what's up guys? Thank you for watching this video. My name is G. I'm the blogger behind Exotic Philippines. That's info. And in this YouTube channel, I talk about flights, airports, hotels, and many more. But sa video na to, ay pag-uusapan natin ang boarding pass. At kailangan mo ba itong iprint? And since madami kayong nagtatanong nito, I decided to have an exclusive video at even a short video about it. So baka nagtataka kayo, bakit kailangan ko iprint ba ang boarding pass? Bakit yung airport hindi ba magpiprint? Well, actually, this question will come up if mag web check in kayo. Kasi pag nag check in kayo sa airport, sila na mismo ang mag print ng boarding pass. It used to be just like a receipt paper in just like a few days, nawawala yung text. But basing on my last flights, na notice ko na yung card na talaga yung cardboard na talaga na paper, which is really good. Kasi maganda siya pang, you know, souvenir. Sa mga hindi pa nagkapanood sa mga previous video ko, ang boarding pass ay makukuha mo after ka mag-check-in. So, pag mag-check-in ka, web check-in, or sa airport na check-in, kiosk check-in, bibigyan ka nito ng boarding pass. Ito ay proof mo na ikaw ay isa sa makonfirmed na pasahero sa aeroplano or sa flight na yon. At at the same time, ito yung proof mo if may check-in bag ka. Ito yung proof mo na may baggage ka na match sa boarding pass mo. At the same time, andun nakalagay yung seat number, gate number mo. But wait a minute, kaping mainit. I would just like to ask you guys if gusto niyo itong mga content na to o natutulungan ko kayo sa inyo first time fly. Oh, tama ba yun? <laughs> so kung natutulungan ko kayo, sana i-consider niyo naman na mag-subscribe kayo. Kasi ang dami-dami niyo nanonood lang tapos hindi kayo nagsusubscribe. Maawa naman kayo para mag-reach naman tayo ng 10,000 subscribers. Because right now, as of making this video, we are just 5,000 subscribers. But anyway, and yun nga, na probably right now, if na web check in kayo or in app check in, natanggap niya ang inyong boarding pass. So nagtata kayo kung anong gagawin niyo sa boarding pass, ipiprint mo ba ito o hindi. So actually, it's your choice. It's up to you. But I would suggest if international flight siya, you should print it out. Domestic, I usually just have it on my phone, screenshot. And I think lately, some airlines have been strict. So, kailangan mo nang sa app mismo, ng example, ng Cebu Pacific, ipapakita yung boarding pass mo. So, hindi na yung screenshot. So, napakasimple lang nito, guys. If hindi, before kayo makapasok ng airport, pwede nyo ipakita nito sa security guard. Tapos, diretso kayo sa mga security checks. If sa boarding gate, ipapakita nila yung phone. Kasi hindi, usually, if yung physical talaga na, ano, yung paper or board, uh, cardboard paper talaga na boarding pass, is may pupunit sila na part ng boarding pass. Since yung boarding pass mo is yung digital copy or soft copy, uh, kailangan mo lang ipakita. And usually, based on my experience naman, titignan nila, titignan lang nila ito. As for those airports na high-touch, high tech like dito sa Cebu uh, hindi ka makakapasok sa boarding area or doon sa um, area kung saan ka pwede maghintay sa iyong uh, malapit sa iyong gate hindi ka makakapasok doon kung wala ang boarding pass kasi ipapaskan yung boarding pass doon sa parang uh, turn file papasok ka tapos yung ganun ganun turn time yung tawag doon but I'll show you this one uh, so, ang gagawin mo lang is actually pretty much the same sa physical na boarding pass as sa digital copy na boarding pass. I, like, it can detect the ano, barcode sa iyong phone na yung doon sa boarding pass sa app. What I just do is to open the app, show my boarding pass, then scan my boarding pass doon sa turn tile, and then it just detects. If it does not detect, usually naman, if, if you're encountering issues, some airports have encountered issues. We cannot avoid that when you not in may iwasan na may may issues sa um, mga boarding pass. So usually there are airport staff, airport security that can help you. So don't be afraid to ask na hindi ka mahapas tapos valid na may boarding pass mo. So that's pretty much it. Again, it depends on you kung gusto mo print or hindi. Kasi iba sa atin, mas preferred yung naho-hold talaga, diba? So, baka some of you, mas preferred may yung ipiprint talaga. O, okay lang sa inyo yun na yung digital copy. But again, what I would suggest, if domestic, you can totally use the digital copy. Pwede mo gamitin yung digital copy or yung nasa app mo. 
o nasa ano mo sa cellphone but for international flights i do suggest na i-print out mo yon sana nakatulong to ang video sa inyo please do consider subscribing to this channel like this video give this video a thumbs up and see you guys on the next video again this is g